All right, yo, what up everyone? You guys got the Barkage of the Hidden Gains Village. Here today, quick video, but the knowledge is valuable. Today I'm going to be telling you guys about one of the most important and beneficial skills uh, for calisthenics uh, static training. And if you are someone who is uh, really focusing on training static skills and wants to get better at statics, then this, in my opinion, 100% needs to be in your training in some way, shape, or form. And if it's not, go ahead and add it in because this is the supinated grip back lever hold. And I know what you guys are thinking, well, what about the pronated back lever? <clears throat> well, the supinated grip back lever is amazing because of the amount of pressure that it puts on your <clears throat> Uh, elbows, right? And uh, that can be really good conditioning for more advanced skills such as the Maltese, Planche, Hefesto, um, I mean, Iron Cross even. Like a lot of skills, training supinated back lever is probably going to help you. And even further with the stuff <clears throat> relating to Maltese and Planche, uh, is, the, is the body alignment. So when you're in a supinated back lever, right? Well, let me actually demonstrate it because I haven't done that yet. So a supinated back lever pretty much looks like this. I'm going to show you right here. Boom. You just come down. And if you are really a beast, you can do this. Okay. See that? That's some supinated back lever, right? So, um, okay, yeah. So... Super great uh, core conditioning as well because your body alignment is the same as it would be in a Maltese or planche. <clears throat> so it's very helpful for that. Now, the next tip is um, also like if you're advanced, right? A back lever is not a super challenging exercise. So you're able to essentially do high, maybe higher volume of this exercise because it's so easy and it's really good conditioning. Now, for those of you that are more towards the beginner intermediate side and you're not amazing at supinated grip back lever, that's okay. I'm gonna show you guys some great exercises that are similar to the supinated back lever that can still help you with these skills, okay? So <clears throat> now I have a back lever tutorial on the channel. So if you are interested in learning the back lever, go check that out for a more detailed one. This is pretty much just some uh, supinated conditioning exercises. So the first one, you have the assisted supinated grip uh, back lever hold. Uh, so you're pretty much just going to start on the bar with a supinated grip like so. Come down and you're just going to hold the supinated grip back lever for time. Just like this. Okay, so, and another great exercise um, is just the supinated grip German hang. Um, I'm going to demonstrate that on the rings here. So you just want to come down. Oh, shoot, that Hefesto. I, I mean, <laughs> dang it. All right, hold up, fam. <laughs> okay, here we go. Supinated German hang. All right, yeah, there we go. Okay, that's a supinated German hang. <clears throat> and yeah, so you just wanna hold these exercises for time, really focus on having the elbows locked out, uh, protracting your shoulders while you hold this. And uh, yeah, I recommend just kind of maybe incorporating these holds, maybe at the end of your skill training as sort of an accessory or whatever. Um, but yeah, uh, definitely add this into your training, super helpful, it really helped me a lot with Maltese planche and all these other skills. Uh, with that said, guys, thank you for checking out the video. If you like the video, please uh, leave a like. Also, please uh, subscribe to the channel if you're new here. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Deuces.